take a quick first look at my new nano amp today. So this arrived this week. It's tiny. It is nano. All right. It's not actually much bigger than a mobile phone. Um, the face of it. So what is it? It's a Hughes and Kettner very well known established amp maker and this is part of their spirit nano series and it is spirit of vintage so i was overly excited as always um when this arrived this week um i decided a little while ago that really i needed to start looking at some kind of guitar amplification i'm more a bass player um, and i do have a couple of um ukulele amp sort of more designed for electro acoustic so this little booty has come to fill the space um little bit of high gain on this basically i was um in an r in whether to get one or not and suddenly it was in the black friday sales so 139 pounds um i'm gonna very quickly run through lots of the features of it and of course we'll have a little listen so just before I grab my new exosphere again, a uh, little bit more about this amp. Now I'm running it through my bare-faced bass cab at the minute. You can do that. Don't go running bass stuff through guitar cabs, but this is fine. I am thinking maybe I should look at getting a, a guitar cab at some point, and that might make a difference, but this certainly works with this cab making another mini rig so the spirit of vintage as i just said is part of the series they actually do three i think there's a rock version um, and a metal version as well but i thought no this is probably the most suitable certainly for what i want to do with it i'm not going to use it with any pedals today you're going to hear it just literally amp and ukulele <laughs> So a nice clean signal, in other words, um, the volume, the master is quite low and the gain is certainly under 12 o'clock. You'll hear the difference that makes in a moment. Behind me there, um, hopefully you should see the decibel reader. Worth keeping an eye on that just to see how loud or quiet it is. So a nice clean tone. <laughs> One of the reasons I wanted this one, apart from it being silly small and relatively cheap for what you're getting, um, is that the reviews of this did say that there was a really nice clean sound. I'm not going to use it with an electroacoustic uke today, but that will certainly come in the future. But I, I want, you know, I don't want everything with loads of distortion and loads of high gain. <laughs> So I just wanted to give you a little idea of how different um, 
the sound can be just altering the different pickups and um, settings and things on the ukulele. So that was all clean settings. Let's just have a little play with this for now. So you've got master, sagging, uh, tone and gain. Now, as I said, the master is the master volume. The gain is going to push the gain up. Tone is what it says it is. The sagging, I've read the manual and the instructions and I'm still no wiser. So the easiest thing to do um, is have a little mess with it and see how it alters the sound. So I'm going to turn the master down a little bit and the gain just past 12 o'clock. See what that does. I'm hoping I'm not going to get it distorting with the actual audio equipment too much. <laughs> I have no idea uh, what the decibel reader uh, is reading. That seemed quite loud to me. So this time, master down a bit more, gain up a bit more. <laughs> enjoying the sound off this I've got to say considering there's no pedals at the minute this is just this going into that you know you can get a really nice sort of bluesy sound with it so gain up further master down a bit more <laughs> I feel we've gone a little bit quieter there, so I'm just going to turn the master up a tiny little bit. enjoying that volume with that gain so let's just see what happens let's turn the sagging right up it's at 12 o'clock at the minute so <laughs> back down to 12 o'clock tone up I hope it's not too harsh um, and bear in mind I'm just staying on the same pickup um, configuration at the minute too <laughs> sagging up a little bit and the tone up a little bit um, let's go full gain I have no idea what this is going to sound like <laughs> up a little bit and we'll have one more little play it's certainly going to be interesting for me as well because obviously I've not heard any of this being recorded just for info I've got my large condenser mic in the front I am running a line out but I don't know what that's going to sound like and my normal overhead mic hopefully it's not distorting too much <laughs> may have 
have clipped out. I apologise. So as I said at the beginning, it isn't all about rock. It isn't all about distortion and high gain. I did want something that was going to sound nice and clean just to amplify as well. And it will be interesting in the future to see if this makes any difference with a guitar cab, not a bass cab like this one. So there we go. That is my Hughes and Kettner Spirit of Vintage Nano Amp. And it really is very, very small and it's so light. So again, another great mini rig. I do hope you've enjoyed that. I just wanted to share my sort of first look with you. Um, I'm going to take a little while to get used to this, but I am loving the sound that's coming off it at the minute. With this one, I will, of course, try it out with other ukuleles as well. Um, but as always, if you've got a comment or a question, please feel free, leave it below. Give us a like if you've enjoyed. And don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on new videos. Thank you for watching.